Welcome friends. In the previous tutorial, we covered lists, tuples and related functions. In this tutorial, we shall continue with Python data structures and cover disc dictionaries and sets. We have already covered some basics of dictionaries in the tutorial on statistics. Here, we shall revisit those concepts and some new ones. We give it a name and it returns a corresponding number. Dictionaries are just key value pairs. For each key, there is a corresponding value associated with it. In lists, we use indexes to access the elements. In dictionaries, we use keys. Let's start by typing IPython in the terminal. Flower brackets are used to create Python dictionaries. Let's create a dictionary. Say player equal to open flower brackets mat colon 134 comma in colon 233, comma, runs, colon, 10823, comma, avg, colon, 52.53, close flower bracket and hit enter. Let's see what player contains by typing print player. It is a dictionary storing the statistics of a cricket player. Here mat, in, etc. are the keys. In order to get the average of this player, we simply type print player of avg and that displays the average. To add a new key value pair to this dictionary, we type player of name which is the key equal to Rahul Dravid which is the value. As you can see, the given key value pair has been added. Let's check by typing print player. Please note that Python dictionaries don't maintain the order in which the key value pairs are stored. The order might change as we add new entries. In dictionaries, duplicate keys are overwritten. That is, when we do player of mat equal to 139 it won't create a new entry rather it will simply overwrite the previous value with the new one so print player will have the updated value as we covered in one of the previous tutorials for can be used to iterate through this the same is possible in case of dictionary